I am Scott Howden, and I want to share with you exciting news about my most recent book entitled Holy is His Name, The Transforming Power of God's Holiness in Scripture. I've been working for two or three years on this project. And why? Because as Catholics, we all know that holiness is to be prized above everything else. Unfortunately, we don't always understand exactly what holiness means. And so what I do in this book is to focus on how holiness is that which is proper to God alone. You alone are holy. On the other hand, we are called to holiness, but it's something that exceeds our power. It exceeds our understanding. It's beyond our grasp, and yet it's not beyond what God can do in our lives, through Christ, by the power of the Holy Spirit. And yet, in the Old Testament, we discover that many things are described as holy, but nobody is ever called a saint. And yet, in the New Testament, what we find is an explosion of holiness applied to people, ordinary people, sinners who are being transformed into saints. It goes barely noticed at all. That in the Old Testament, you have holy furniture, you have holy vestments, you have holy sacrifices, you have holy places. And yet, nobody's called a saint. And then suddenly, as we turn from the old to the new, we barely even notice that the Holy Spirit overshadows the Blessed Virgin in order to bring about the Holy One of God, but in order to give us what Christ alone possesses from all eternity. What is it? Holiness. It's more than ethical rectitude. It's more than just keeping the law. It's more than just righteousness. Holiness is primarily vertical. That is, it orients us to God and allows God to come and possess us in a whole new way. But at the same time, it empowers us to go forth in life and to transform our friendships, our relationships, our home life as well. I am convinced that holy is his name has that potential for your life in prayer, but also in your marriage, in your family life, in your parishes as well. I am convinced that as we come to a better understanding of what holiness means in sacred scripture, we're going to experience the release of the power of holiness in our own lives, and yes, even in this world that seems so corrupt and lost. So I encourage you to get hold of Holy is His Name by going to stpaulcenter.com. Thank you so much. Until we meet again, I pray that God will richly bless you.